Renewed hostilities between the Colombian government and FARC rebels have resulted in the death of a guerrilla commander in the state of Chocó in the northwest of the country. With some 80% of the votes counted, it looks like incumbent president Desi Buterson will retain his job in the South American country of Suriname. Buterson's National Democratic Party appears to have won 27 seats of the nation's 51-seat Congress during Monday's general elections. Relatives and activists in Mexico have organized protests to mark eight months since the 43 students from Ayotzinapa were forcibly disappeared. Marches from four different places in Mexico City will try to enter the Zócalo Square simultaneously. The United Socialist Party of Venezuela has begun its primary campaign for congressional elections later this year. Over 1,000 candidates will be selected by popular movements to run in the general elections. A severe heat wave has stricken southern states in India. It has killed over 750 people since mid-April. Experts have predicted that similar conditions will continue for the next two weeks.